At least seven companies with links to people close to Ace Marashule were allegedly awarded tenders for personal protective equipment. Two of Marashule's sons are amongst those said to have benefited. Free State Treasury maintains that procurement processes were followed in line with the instructions from National Treasury for emergency PPE procurement. Our process did not take any consideration of political uh, relationships uh, that are transpiring in the province or anywhere nationally. We only focused on the administration and ensuring that the prescripts are followed in that regard. The provincial treasury says nothing prohibits family members of government employees from doing business with the state. However, they must declare. It admits that Tebang Motaung, son of veteran broadcaster Tuso Motaung, was awarded a 4.7 million rand tender. Mabilo says he will have to verify whether Tebang Motaung did in fact declare that his father was a public servant. Motaung Sr. works in the office of the Free State Premier. ANC Alliance partner, the SACP, has called for an investigation. It is very clear that these tenders breeds corruption and take away the capacity of the state to deliver services. It would be a sad day that those with proximity to the state are the only ones who are getting these tenders. We are therefore calling for an investigation into these tenders of the PPEs. The opposition is investigating the core functions of companies that were awarded tenders. The Diana Free State Legislature are also investigating the awarding of all contracts regarding COVID-19. We are not just investigating directors, but we are also investigating the core business of all these companies. It's a disgrace to think that there are companies that put ties with ANC that's enriching themselves rather than bring some relief to the people and businesses in the Free State that's suffering under the virus. The provincial government has released a statement declaring that neither the Premier nor the MEC for Finance were involved in PPE procurement processes. It also states that investigations into and the auditing of COVID-19 related tender processes are underway. I am Palasamo ATS, ABC News, Bloomfontein.